Hey guys, it's Framed, and today I'm here to bring you a guide done easy on how to earn favor with the Shazian house on the new continent, Zaya. So to start this out, you get to the Shazian house by getting off the docks and running west towards you get to the area that says Great Corin. There's a huge statue, then you go to the southwest. Once you make it towards the little combat arena or the combat circle, you can then follow what I do on screen, but I went to the little circle and then I went to the southeast to start earning favors. The first thing you have to do to start earning favors is you have to speak to this nurse, which you might not even have to actually speak to the nurse because when I started the other favors, I didn't actually have to speak to anyone. So you do that and then offer to help her and go in here and right click and then just take all of these packs. You can just do right click and take many. And then you come in here, which this thing's a little annoying by the way at the top, but you know what? I'm sure I'll get used to it. You come into all of these tents and then you just talk to these guys and you can talk to them all one by one. You're going to do this until about 5% and uh, I think it's like 0.1% every time you heal one of these guys. And uh, it's also worth mentioning that not only is there an upstairs, but even though that there is an upstairs and there's extra soldiers, if other people are talking to these soldiers, then you will not be able to heal them because, I don't know, I guess that's just the way it is. So once you get 5%, I got like 5.2%, but that doesn't really matter. You can just gear up. I brought a cannon to do this uh, as fast as possible. Then go towards the northwest until you reach this area, then climb down here. I tried to find an empty world uh, where there was no cannon. And no people, so I wasn't really disturbing anyone, except these guys. Nope, just kidding. I didn't even serve them. And there is a, a single and a multi-area, but obviously I just did the multi-area. And you are going to cannon these guys until you are about 40% um, in favor of the House Shazian. Uh, it's also worth noting that these guys, they're not the best. Like They're probably decent for low levels, but like if you're low level, I probably wouldn't do this uh, with a cannon if you want to make money here. So you get three signature drops from them. You get th uh, this cloth, which is currently 1K in the Grand Exchange. You get these fangs um, or teeth or whatever you want to call it, the lizardman teeth. And then you get this uh, talisman. It's Zarek's talisman. And I'm going to show you where these teleports lead to later. But if anything, this is really worth doing just for that because I don't believe you can get that, this talisman from anywhere else. So... You can kill these lizard men for a while, and that's about it. So um, next, I'm going to show you something that you don't really need to do, but you technically don't really need to do any of this. You can just kill lizard men until 100%. But this was just a bit of fun for me. So go um, when you're back in the circle, when you're about 40%, go towards the east, and you can see this on the map. Uh, it's like a little rectangular house. It's uh, directly east of that like circle of the fighting circle which you'll see later. You can go there and you can offer to help fight organized crime and then you could always check the board. It's kind of like, um, how do you say it? it? It was kind of like those asteroids or whatever you want to call it uh, when you mine the stars in the previous runescape. I I'm not necessarily sure what it is because I never did it. But uh, it was like a daily event or something like that. Um, I, I don't know how to describe it but either way you get a task to help fight organized crime and then you uh, are giving a note to go to the area or you can just uh, talk to her and she'll give you the note and then you can read the board and I'll tell you where and then you know you'll get the note overall but you pretty much just uh, go towards the area and then you wait the amount of time until the actual crime spree happens so for this one, I only had to wait about 11 minutes because that was what the timer was on it. And I was just asking this guy here, did you wait for the uh, organized crime? So then uh, he hopped. And then this guy, this guy didn't freaking hop, which sucked. And it kind of ruined my XP because you want to do this with no one else in the world. So uh, they came here. And then you technically could just hop around, I suppose, and uh, keep getting a lot of XP. But I didn't really want to chance it. Uh, I, that's just a theory. You probably could do that, but I'm not necessarily sure. That, that would probably be really overpowered XP, though, because I got, like, about 6% XP or something like that, or 6% uh, uh, favor, my, my mistake, in, I want to say, like, what, 20 seconds? Obviously, it took a, a decent amount of time to wait for that, but if you are able to hop around, then that would be very overpowered. So if that does work, then please let me know in the comment section below because that would be very overpowered. And probably, obviously, patch, but, you know. 
anyway, so um, once you do that, I would uh, get the intelligence. I looted the intelligence as one of the drops, and then you come back to the uh, captain. She'll exchange that for a book, and you can just get a little bit of extra XP, which is pretty good. So then, as I said, I got about 6% favor, which is pretty sweet, and I didn't really wait around for any more uh, raids or whatever they're called. So after that, you don't even have to do that again. Like you could technically just do lizard men to 100%. You could technically just do anything to 100%. These are just uh, little rewards that you can get. Like this guy, I believe, uh, did this until about 100% because that looks like the 5% armor, 100% armor. Oh my goodness, the tier five or the highest tier five armor. So when you reach certain level of um, favors, then you can start fighting all of these uh, tier dudes. Like uh, you can start fighting the tier one through five, and you just get the armor. But the armor is really crap. So this is uh, me showing you what the amulets uh, or where the am amulets teleport to. This first one is right by House Shazian, uh, by the looks of it. And then the next one, which this one is very helpful. This teleports you right to these magic trees, so I would really recommend doing this if you want to get a free magic tree spot because this could be very overpowered as well because uh, not only that, but there is a bank, yeah, as you can see, right to the southwest, so you can do that or you can just get a glory as well. It doesn't uh, really matter, but like it's very fast uh, and very convenient magic trees that you can use. So then there is the third one as well, which this teleports you to the northern part of the map. And this teleports you right towards this uh, furnace where you can go blast mining. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this guide. So if it helped you out in any way, please be sure to give it a like. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.